I'm gonna show you how I turn my FPV drone into a drone that can deliver packages or payloads or whatever you wanna deliver and drop stuff off the bottom. Super easy DIY, basic materials that you probably have laying around the house. No 3D printer needed. Let's go. Start by taking a look at how I have my servo arranged on the bottom of the FPV drone. So we've got the arm here that's gonna move up and down and then that's gonna pull that little key looking metal piece out of these two zip tie grooves there and then you can attach some type of rope or some type of string in between right there and it's gonna hold and then it's gonna release once you pull the button. So that's how you can use the servo to drop something but I'm gonna show you how I attached the little metal piece here to the servo because that's kind of the most important part and it's really simple. All right, so check it out. What we have here is some type of key type of thing. It's like a key knife, but it's simple just to demonstrate what I'm trying to do. And then I've got the servo that we're trying to attach here. And then I've just got a, a basic paper clip. So we're gonna take this thing and we're gonna try to straighten that out a little bit here. And then try to attach the one side around the servo end here. You see, and it helps if you've got some type of pliers or something with you, if you've got some tools. Wrap that side around, and then get that nice little loop there. And then you're gonna try to do the same thing with your other side to connect that to the servo. Boom, there you go. Get some scissors and try to snip off the two little ends of the metal pieces to make it look better. And then attach that arm back to your servo, screw it on, and then I'll show you what to do on the drone side. So here we go, back to the drone side again. I have my my servos attached using some double-sided tape onto the bottom, and it doesn't need to be too strong or anything like that because you're not really applying that much um, pressure right there on the servo itself. It's mostly just gonna be on these zip ties over here. So what you do here is attach two zip ties close together on your FPV drone frame, where you have some type of little groove that this key can slide through. I have a different metal key here that's a little bit flatter. And then what you can do to make sure that it's perfectly flush there, there we go, that's where it is when it activates, is you bend your paper clip into place. That's why it's good to have something like that. And then it's gonna be ready to activate when you pull the trigger on your controller. And it's gonna pull that key down and pull that arm out like I was showing earlier. So here's my makeshift uh, Amazon package here. I've got a little bit of um, fishing line string attached to the top and I duct taped the zip tie to the top to attach to that, but you can pretty much put this little little tie thing on any package you want. So then, got that, I've got some rocks on the inside and it's clocking in at 483 grams. So we're almost at 500 grams, guys. And I know this thing can carry that much. So yeah, there we go. That's how we've got the servos attached and then you attach that fishing line to the bottom. It's kind of hard, but it, it works. And then you're ready to drop stuff. All right guys, I'm gonna take off with the drone and then try to drop the box into the other box over there. Let's see if I can do it. <laughs> All right guys, that was my DIY drone delivery system. Thanks for staying tuned till the end of the video. Make sure you smash the like button because you know it helps the algorithm and don't forget to subscribe because you know there's more content coming. Peace.